Hello and welcome to the show. I'm here on Turbo Dismount looking at the final couple of levels from the uh, the recent update. The first one, we have got Monorail Incident with a flying train. With a picture that has a flying train is normally quite a good sign for a level, I think. So <laughs> we're going to go here. Okay. I'm... My guess is train comes along and flies off there as per the picture and then we have to aim a car at it or something. I don't know. Okay, well, let's just have a look. What have we got? Oh, we've got many options of of placing things around. Um, hmm. Okay, well, maybe. I'm not sure if it maybe go maybe go for sort of this boost and jump. I'm thinking boost and jump with a, a car of sorts. I don't know if we're actually going to hit the target or let's just go for it and kind of see what happens and hope that we sort of... Okay, so no, that was just a, a crash, basically. Um, car's gone... <laughs> car's, car's gone and driven into the train. Well done on that. Uh, and it's still going. It's just doing a burnout over there. That's... Hmm. Okay, car. Okay, um, right, I'm not quite sure how to best use this, uh, we could steer, ah, I've got an idea, kind of got an idea anyway, um, okay, we go for bus, uh, and we go for little diddy speed, if we can time this right, the train will come off and squash the camper van, train, oh, we've missed it, uh, almost, oh no, Perfect! <laughs> Absolutely perfectly positioned right there. And catapult out the front. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Uh, right, so the train goes over the bridge because of that bit of uh, guardrail, if you like. I, I couldn't have timed that much better if I'd really tried, to be honest. Because we can't get the train to land on it in any other situation, can we? I don't think. Because the train is always, I just have a, let's just have a look. Uh, the train is always going to go over the bridge here, so it lifts up that. To, I guess let a car in, perhaps. I'm not sure. Uh, and then as we come through here, the they just have the, tra the the weight of a train falling on top of a uh, <laughs> EW camper, which is always a good thing. Always a good thing that. Uh, hmm. Okay. And then we, we're still getting damaged, and then we get catapulted out the front. I'm not sure how best to get to get points on here, because if we go up here and try and maybe we try to tackle the train midair, maybe that would be funny. Maybe that would work. Who knows? Let's give it a try. I think this is probably the best sort of vehicle for. Tr Oops, I've clicked in the wrong place. I do apologise. Uh, I'm making a bit too much too much speed there. Uh, I've got to change the steering. Never mind. It's fine. We're gonna we're gonna take out the little the <laughs> take out the uh, the girder, and that's broken everything. No, that's not what we wanted to do at all. Uh, we wanted to have the steering. I don't quite know what the purpose of going over there would be. Like over there is no the train's never gonna impact over there. I wouldn't have thought. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm trying to think of a way of using it. And that way, I mean, it kind of makes sense ish. We're going to go for try the aerial attack on the train. I think we're going to get there too fast. I don't think the train's going to make it. Oh, I think if we could drive the blooming VW thing straight. Nope. <laughs> we're just going to park there. Hmm. Okay, maybe what would work better then is if we got rid of this. Yeah, and then we drive up there sort of at a nice leisurely pace. So we're not going to lose control, hopefully, going up the ramp, but we may have been a little bit too leisurely. No! Train! You're going to get the... F oh, the train beat us to it. We're just going <laughs> to clonk into the, the back end of the train and, and do not much. Hmm. Okay, maybe a little bit more speed. A little bit more speed. But, oh, that's, that was not enough speed. My bad. Uh, we want... That's probably too much. Never mind. We'll give it a try. I think we're just going to lose control, though. Try to get up here. Ooh. Ooh. No, we fall... <laughs> You were the worst driver ever. You were a terrible driver. <laughs> Trying to keep control. It's only a camper van. It's not that difficult. I think that may be enough speed. Right, so don't hit the curb. Okay, now we're good. Come on. Go, go. Accelerate now. Accelerate. No, most. 
Almost got it. We're going to get clipped by the... No, quite going to get clipped by the train again. Almost got it. So we need sort of speed around there-ish, I think, would be good. I think but there's, there's not a huge amount of stuff to damage a, a thing on in this level. That's probably a bit too much speed. Uh, to actually get, get points on, you get high scores with multiple crashes and stuff. But this, we've already got one thing. Uh, we've gone too fast. We've mistimed it again. <laughs> the, oh, we're still going. We're still going. We, oh, now we're not. The tree uh, stopped us. Hmm. I just want to get that. That looks good. I think I've got that. I just want to get this this this, <laughs> this bit right. We've got the sweet spot of speed. Here comes the train. Are we going to hit, get hit? Oh. <laughs> not quite. God damn it. Hmm. Right. How... How, how else would we get points other than that? I mean, we could do that one, and then I'm thinking if we went... I don't think this is going to work. Uh, if we would do that and that, I mean, this tends to just give us good points regardless of what level we're on. It's kind of a cheaty way of, uh, of scoring some points in a monster truck. Ah, uh, oh, if, if we could time it right with the truck... Oh, I think we're not quite in the right position, are we? Oh, that sucks. Ooh, beheaded in the... <laughs> in the if you could time that right, you could do like an aerial takedown on the train. But I don't think you're in the right... I don't think I can get a jump in the right place. Because it's that's too soon for the straight up one and it's far too late for the... Um... Oh, no, wait. I have an idea. This is a really dumb idea. I don't think it's going to work. But if it does, it'll be amazing. See, if we had... Oh, I don't think if we had a boost there, I think we'd lose control of the monster truck we had that there, could we get there in time and carry enough speed without... Oh, we're just going to lose control of the truck, aren't we? I would I would presume nothing's got good enough handling to get around to that bit in time. I mean, the train... Ooh, the <laughs> come on, come on, you've made it to the ramp, almost. Well, I mean, that's one way to do things. <sighs> I was really glad that that wasn't our high score one. We, for that to work, we need to have control of a car. So I'm thinking, oh, I'm giving that far too much speed, I think. Uh, so if we have control of this around here. Oh, here we go, here we go. Up the jump. Oh, you've oversteered too much, goddammit. Hey, we kind of got the train. Sort of got the train. Hey, we got a high score from it. That's always good. Um, Yeah, if it wasn't such a tight corner, that would work really well. Problem is, we just, just a little bit, a little bit too fast, really, around here. So as we go up here, I mean, we do clip the back of the train. It might work much better if it was a train hitting up. We can't get there much faster, I don't think. We're never going to get to there at any quick. Well, maybe if we don't go quite as much, quite as much speed, if you like, we will have more control. Now uh, we're still not doing very well on the control front. <laughs> we just attacked the underside of a train that time around. Hmm, not so good on the uh, on the points front uh, uh, for that particular manoeuvre. Uh, maybe if we went back to going over that way with something like a scooter, sure, and then we can get splattered by a train. Maybe that'll work if we can make it up the the ramp with the scooter. Don't fall off. Don't fall off. Oh, we've uh, we've gone far too quickly. Far too. Oh, <laughs> take it out by a girder. Uh, okay, no, that, was, that was too much speed. I was I wasn't expecting it to actually be that quick. The uh, the little scooter. Oh, we need to get rid of that. Because otherwise that'll mess up with stuff. Okay, so sort of again around that maybe not quite enough speed. On I don't know. This thing seems no. Nah, it's going to be about the same as the uh, blooming camper van incoming train. Oh, so close, so close. Just need a tiny bit more speed on that one, and then we can get properly squashed. Oh, for God's sake! It's a fine balancing act on turbo dismount to try and get what you want. I think we've gone too quickly this time. Oh no, it might work. Not quite. <laughs> <laughs> Just do a backflip when we hit the uh, barricade thing. All right, let's go back over here. Then we want to go sort of... That's not enough. Not enough speed. Not enough speed. Uh, that could work. I think this could be the one. This could be the one that it'll finally work and we will have timed it perfectly to be skewered by a flying train. Squash! <laughs> there we go. And not as good points as sort of attacking the... Never mind. That's what we wanted to do. We managed to time it right with the help of a scooter. And that's quite a hard one to get points on. Around here, there's just, well, being only one sort of obstacle, one, one moving vehicle. 
uh, yeah, it is quite hard to uh, to get the point. Pretty good aiming, though. Pretty good timing, I would say, there. <laughs> uh, just sort of caught the side of it. That I don't think I'm going to get much better when you're trying to aim stuff on here. Okay. Uh, that's, that's one way to do uh, to do this particular level. Right, on to the, uh, the final level, level. Sorry, split decision. Well, looking like that, we've got some ramps to play around with, and we have some buses. I have, all right, okay, so we can choose what, uh, what one we want to aim for. Okay, okay, what have we got in the way of, I'm presuming we've got, oh, we've got a thing over there? I'm hoping I don't go that, well, if I go that far, we're kind of in trouble, sort of. Um, hmm, now from the looks of it, can we, ah, oh, we can move around, I forgot we can move around, oh, blimey, we can, oh, we can do all of, oh, Jesus, um, I didn't realise you could move this stuff around. That's uh, interesting. <laughs> I thought I could just move the free camera around. Okay. Uh, oh, we've buggered that all up completely. That's why you don't do stuff uh, by accident. We've messed it up. We want that over there and then up. I want it back where it was, please. Like that. Sure. That's good enough. Okay. Uh, <laughs> whoopsie. I thought that would be move the thing qu around quicker. Uh, okay. See, I, was, I wanted to have a look, because I, I think they're all in a line. Which means that if I could boost up here and then jump onto the top bit, uh, and then get knocked down and then knocked down again, that'd be good for the points, if you like. Uh, okay. We'll go for the we'll aim for the middle one, and we'll just do a, do a nice simple boost, boost, and then a boost off the top, and hopefully that's in a good position. I'll right, we'll set that back there. Yes, that's going to work. Uh, and then my... My thinking is if we can bounce off the top bit and then land on the lower one and then land on the one below that as well, uh, that would be pretty. That would be pretty useful. Oh, <laughs> that's not quite worked. Uh, in fact, they aren't perfectly in line, which is good. That's kind of what we need. Uh, and haven't quite got enough speed on the little on the little scooter to do that. We just sort of smacked the edge. Uh, maybe the van, where has it gone? The delivery van. This should be a good intermediate between a scooter and the sort of monster truck or supercar. Uh, what are we doing speed-wise? Are we, yeah, it's a little bit quicker. Oh, we're over the top uh, and we've lost the head. <laughs> maybe overshot a little bit too much on that one. Just a, a tad overshot there. Uh crap uh, it's going to be another one of try and find the nice sort of middle ground so that we don't uh, overshoot completely hmm okay that was a little little bit too much i think we'll go, we could steer off that ramp uh, this one here makes more sense to be honest uh hmm if we were to go for a monster truck but then get rid of them too see what i'm thinking is if we were to shoot down here I think we're going to get too much speed in the monster truck. Uh, we don't lose. Uh, no, we don't lose speed fast enough. We probably don't even need a boost pad. Well, it's an impressive airtime from the truck. And splat! <laughs> Just disintegrate dummy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Every limb has come off by the uh, by the looks of that landing and the limbs being chucked out of the window. It's not something you say very often. Okay, too much. Far too much speed in this thing. Ah, uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty good having the. Because the person stays in the uh, in the monster truck quite well, so if we can if we can clip the first thing and get sort of thrown around and then land on the next ramp, then maybe that'll work. I think we've got enough speed. Oh, just made it. Oh, we go, <laughs> go for a bit of a 360 spin, and well, that part of it's splatted down. The rest is still in the truck. Truck's still making a hell of a lot of. No, oh, no, stop making the noise. Typical. Once the truck's on the floor, it stopped making all of the noise. That's not much fun. Hmm. Okay, that was closer. That was closer. I mean, we, we, we got to the top. of We got clipped on the top thing. I don't know if we could ever aim it to land on the next one. Oh, that's not enough speed at all. My bad. Okay. Well, we're going to have a leisurely jump off the uh, the ramp this time. We're going to make it up the ramp? That is the question. We are. We're not going to make it far enough, though. <laughs> Bugger it. And... Bla oh, it still did enough damage to cut the dummy in half. But uh, <laughs> that's not quite what we were looking for there. Okay, go for the... I think it's about the same, oh, never mind, we'll, we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure how to quite angle it best. And clipped by a bus, and we're going to do exactly the same thing. Only this time the whole dummy came out of the window. Off goes the truck, down over there. Where, where did the head go? <laughs> we just lost the head somewhere. I thought it was still in the truck, but apparently not. Hmm. 
Not sure Monster Truck is the best one for this either. And this is always fun, but uh, it was guaranteed decapitation when you use this dummy in that thing. Uh, okay, we're going to need a couple of boost pads because this thing is not that quick. Uh, that, now I've said it's not that quick, I'm going to get full speed and now we'll be going far too fast. Eddie the Ep, sure enough, we're doing 100 miles. <laughs> for God's sake! <laughs> it's always the way we send a camper van into orbit and splat. Yep, decapitation guaranteed. Uh, that was actually quite decent on the points for just a singular impact. That's quite impressive, but there's not what we're after. Uh, okay, maybe not full speed. I think two boost pads may be a little bit of overkill. Just a small, a small bit of overkill. What speed? Yeah, we're going 100, and 100 is bad for the well, for this. Yeah. Oh, is there, are we not going to have? Oh, we are probably going to have <laughs> the angle of that neck. Yeah, we're going to have decapitation uh, <laughs> in that landing. Okay, the boost pads are overkill. Go away. So we'll have one, one boost pad. I think. Oopsie, click the steering by accident. There we go. Then we will fire with some decent speed. We need some speed, see, uh, to make sure we get up there. 90 miles an hour is all good. Oh, <laughs> almost, almost not quite enough though. God damn it! Is this trying to be precise in this game is very hard. I have a feeling that this is now not going to be quick enough because we just shrug off speed. Oh, it's not quite. It's so close. I fear if we move the uh, the boost pad closer, one closer, I think we'll get end up going overshooting. Perhaps. Go there. We could try just exploding, catapulting the, the, the thing into it, have a mine at the end, but I don't think that's going to really work on this level. Especially not with the angling the way it is. Like, I can't, putting ramps up there is pointless because it's just going to fire it in the wrong direction. Ooh! It's kind of worked! <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to land right on the head. Uh, that was pretty damn good for the points there. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to land it on a different bloody layer of the, the thingamajig. I think it's too, it's too close together. Okay. That worked. It's, I don't think I can get it much better, really, with this. The speed, I can't quite get it right. So we we almost clear it. We're going... Oh, just, just get hit by the bus in time. And then we're twisting around in there and then get just flung out of the uh, the windscreen <laughs> losing an arm in the process hmm okay maybe going for the top rung isn't such a good idea I've just had a cunning idea when I was looking back at that get rid of that if we were to just simply go boost boost and then put a minefield over there so that if we make it that far there can be an explosion okay that's what I'm thinking okay that may uh, I may still clear it by a bit too much I was hoping that this is going to be a bit of a shallower jump, so it will just fire us into the traffic at a low angle. Maybe too big of a jump. We may get too much airtime here. Uh, we oh, not quite got a, a nice enough angle. Well, we've disintegrated and gone into some mines, which is always good fun. And splat on the floor. Oh, <laughs> we got a new high score. Thank you, Camper Van, for running us over. Fantastic. And that, that's always a, a good way to do things. <laughs> Uh, the new high score completely by accident on that one. Okay, maybe the second boost is not quite what we want. Let's get rid of that. I mean, uh, oops, did I not? Hmm, I swear I could. There we go, that's what we want. I clicked the wrong thing. Hmm. Yeah, I, I wanted to try and go at a, at a low height. A high speed, but low height through this traffic so you can have a big crash. Like a big, get a big side swipe from the buses, but I'm not 100% sure we're ever taking quite the right angle. Uh, if in doubt, explosions, and splat again. And you just get good points by firing it into a minefield. Maybe firing it into a minefield isn't such a dumb idea. Here. Sure, this can only end really, really well. Uh, okay, here we go. Fire it at decent speed, and then who knows if we end up in traffic or not. It's a... Uh, <laughs> crash test dummy could go anywhere. And into a bus. Missed the buses completely. Ooh, nice flip. Oh, <laughs> so it survived the minefield the first time, but the second time, or, or it didn't survive. How, does, how do you survive the explosion, but the, the landing? The, I don't know. That doesn't make sense. Uh, okay, maybe we should go with. Let's go with this thing. I haven't used this thing uh, for a while. We'll go with this thing. We'll go with some decent speed. I think this might be a little bit faster. Hit that, explode, and then hope that we end up in some traffic. Or, or we could just clear everything. I think there's a sweet backflip from the truck there, for the jeep, and land on the face. 
and not really much happened. Okay, maybe that was a little bit too much speed. Maybe this is a little bit too quick for doing this. If I, and we've also got to time it with the buses as well coming across because we're going to fire. Oh, bus! No, we're too high. We've got there's another flip from the truck. Oh, it didn't quite stick the landing as well this time. Hmm. Okay, that thing's not good enough. Uh, or it won't, won't work. Maybe this will work then. Hmm. So I don't think it's better being in... So if I go on the roof or something, I think I've got to get too much height. I think by being in here, we stand the best chance of maybe being catapulted. Uh, ooh, are we going to get the bus? No, we're going to clear the bloody road. We're going to hide. <laughs> we're going to hide under the road. We made a little bed in there. Uh, that's not worked either. Hmm. Okay, maybe we will be better on the on the top of this one if we're getting caught up. Uh, who who knows? Just fire at the. Th I just want to get the person to fly off the vehicle into the traffic and then perhaps into the mines behind it. Oh no, we're just <laughs> we're just clearing the whole damn thing and land. <sighs> not working. It's not working. Ooh, one last idea I have. Supercar. Then we're going to get rid of... Uh, ooh, I wonder if these will work, actually. Get rid of the mines. They're just going to catapult us too high. Oh, wait, why am I putting them there? Don't want them there, do I? I meant I want them here. Right, so now what I'm thinking is if we hit them, maybe they will sort of flip us at a strange angle. I don't know what's going to happen. I'm hoping we'll get a spectacular roll. Or just a decapitation. Okay, I mean that that that's one way that you were supposed to flip the car. I think they've <laughs> they've last time I tried them they weren't timed at all. Now they're firing a bit too early. Reset that. Okay, fine. I won't use them. I, I'll use the proper split ramps. See, they tended to be more fun to use to flip cars, but no, no, we're going to have to go with a split ramp to make things work properly. Right, here we go and roll into traffic, into traffic, into traffic. Kind of. That's good enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll I'll take that. I kind of got it to do what I wanted it. Uh, it's only on the on the lower level. Uh, I th <laughs> uh, now we're not going to end the thing. Fine. Okay, we will do it once more then on the on the on the big jump. Show up. don't want that. That's just going to send us backwards. Um, will the supercar have enough speed? I think it probably will. To be honest. Uh, all right, we'll fire it at the highest highest level. There we go. See what on earth happens. Come on, supercar. We'll have a grand finale. Oh, we've <laughs> disintegrated the front. Oh, we're going to overshoot. Yeah, it's, it's too quick. It's too quick and, ooh, broken back. But still landed in the seat. So, <laughs> well, I guess that's, that's, that's kind of a good thing. Can we, I just want to go maybe a little, maybe a little slower will work on this. I mean, even smacking the front bumper and having the car fall apart didn't slow it down enough. There we go. That's sort of more like it. Oh, we can't quite get thrown off the wrong way. Well, there we go. That's it for these uh, final couple of the levels on uh, Turbo Dismount. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. And until next time, a goodbye.